everyone welcome back to my channel finally 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 I feel good enough to do my clothing haul thrift store clothing haul um, video now this haul was from a Goodwill store but not in Conway uh, this Goodwill haul was from Goodwill in Myrtle Beach and I set myself a budget I unfortunately went over um, one thing I did notice in that store is obviously because of the location prices were a little bit higher than the Goodwill and Conway but that is to be expected it is after all a tourist area and everything down there obviously does cost a little bit more same back in PA and Jim Thorpe um, same thing so it was a really nice store um, again friendly people um, friendly workers and a wonderful wonderful selection now I noticed something down here in the south compared to back in PA um, I know back in PA there is some Goodwill stores that actually sell clothing and things by the pound I didn't have any in my local area but there is some that do um, I don't know if there's any down here that do that and also back in PA everything actually had tags at least the store in my town did um, down here I noticed they don't they just basically have us a, a little tag on with the size and smalls will be all grouped together could be small shorts could be small shorts could be small um, capris like if it's in the same general category say like summer clothing you'll have shorts capris maybe um jeggings all like based on size now that throws me off just a little bit um i don't know i think in a way for me it makes it harder for me to actually find what i'm looking for when i have to root through so many other things that are small size now, of course, they do have like t-shirts separate, long sleeve shirts separate, etc. But I'm just saying if you have, you know, small jeans, small shorts, small capris all together and you're just looking for a pair of shorts, you might have to really rummage through for five minutes everything until you might find what you're looking for. That's the only drawback to me with that method of doing things. Um... But all in all, you know, the Goodwill stores down here have amazing selections. And I uh, can't wait to, um, you know, get back to maybe the one in Conway again. Or maybe, you know, look up another one. Um, perhaps the Salvation Army store. Uh, Joe told me there's a Salvation Army in Florence where he's from. So perhaps down the road I'll go there and do a video there. We'll, we'll see. Anywho. This haul was actually from, oh my God, over three weeks ago. Um, I honestly didn't get the chance to work on it because I had started doing the DIY and I had stopped with working. Um, that chair, when I finally finished up, I was able to do that on a day off. So it is hard sometimes. And then recently I just had allergies on top of a head cold. I had a what they call swimmers ear in my ear canal um, I got an infection in my right ear canal and it was bleeding total craziness total craziness but anywho enough babbling let me get into the video righty so I is gonna start with shorts now these are shorts to wear to bed they say we are all stardust um, and these are just for sleep now these are small but they actually look stretchy enough to be a medium so I grab these again I don't have prices simply because of the way um, prices are on signs uh, in the store 
these are a small as well and I got these kind of shorts because they're good for work and reason being is that they're loose they're comfortable you can move around as compared to wearing say denim shorts or leggings something like that um, it's just easier I noticed to actually now that it's getting warmer just to wear shorts those kind of shorts they're great for cleaning it's a medium uh, this would actually be good for work as well could wear like a uh, uh, a sports bra and maybe like a thin camisole or something underneath it again really good for work here is another little camisole this is express brand yeah and this is a medium as well again these are just good for the summer and good for work now I grabbed a long sleeve t-shirt um, only because hey it does get chilly sometimes and I'm noticing that it's good to have a couple of long sleeve shirts handy for that type of chill because it's not cold enough for a heavy hoodie or sweatshirt but cool enough that yeah a long sleeve t-shirt is good so this is a Myrtle Beach South Carolina long sleeve tie-dye and uh, I fell in love with this as soon as I seen this this is a medium now this item that I found um, really really caught my eye Joe was sort of shocked that I would buy it but he doesn't know me and know how I used to dress when I used to go out when I was younger and so this caught my eye I said yep yeah, this is going to be my go out skirt definitely well unless it's too hot then I might wear a denim skirt but ta-da how cool is this now it's not a mini skirt this is actually a really nice um, little bit above the knee length skirt and uh, it has this cool belt with it and uh, I just thought this was really really cute and this is a medium as well and lastly I found not one but two pair of ankle jeans um, I found this pair which is really really cute and they have the tears in them if you can see um, and I tried all these items on too in store so those are let me see what size are they those are medium now these are roll crop skinny Jessica Simpsons and yet these fit me when I tried them on they fit actually quite well and they're small so again it shows you differences in sizes well guys let me stop yakking let me try everything on for you so I figured the first item that I would try on for y'all is this black skirt it is vinyl or pleather if you want to call it um, the leather look and I just fell in love with this darn thing brought back some good memories of my younger days and how I used to dress and what I used to wear and um, yeah I was more into the uh, I guess you could say fishnet stockings high heels teased up feathered hair leather jackets leather skirts all that kind of stuff I even had a pair of leather jeans at one point too so um yeah and uh to see something like this even if it isn't the real thing just brings back some fun memories for me and uh, this has nice deep pockets too um and i just really think this would look cute with heels i think it would look cute with boots too depending on the boots um I don't know I think you could you know wear this with a lot of different shirts and stuff and it would look pretty cool all right so I thought I would kill two birds with one stone I have on the tie-dye Myrtle Beach t-shirt long sleeve shirt I got 
And I also have on the Jessica Simpson um, skinny crop jeans that are rolled up at the ankle. And as I said, these fit really, really good. And now these are small. So go figure. I all it all I can say is you really have to try clothes on. Um, you just never know. You can't always go by sizes. You could have same size and five different pair of jeans and they're all going to fit you different. But these fit really, really good. And so, you know, once again, um, yeah, these are pretty cool. Got the camisole top on. And I have this pair of jeans on. Now, one thing I noticed, they're longer. They go down like right to my ankle, rolled up. And they're really, really comfortable and they fit good. But there is something weird I did notice. The buttonhole right here is not open. So I can't actually put the button through. So I'm going to have to take a sharp pair of scissors and cut in there to open that up to um, button these. But otherwise, these fit really good. Now, these are a medium. So, I mean, again, you have to try things on. You really, really do. You can't just go by sizes. Same with shoes. Same. So this is this gray cutout back top. As I said, I like that back with the cutout. I would wear that to work. Um, maybe with like a little camisole under it. And these are the uh, shorts. Again, these are really, really comfortable. Um, cool to wear when you are uh, cleaning. And these fit really good too. So, alrighty. Last item coming. Last item of this haul is my sleep shorts. And uh, these say we are all stardust. Yes, they are a little bit short, I do admit, but they're for bed. I'm not going to wear them to run a Walmart or anything like that. They're to sleep in, especially when it's hot. So, I mean, you know, what the heck. Well, guys, that is it for this thrift store haul. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. And if you haven't already, hit my subscribe button. Uh, don't forget to hit that alarm bell for all so you are notified every time I do upload a new video. Take care, and I will see you all on my next one. Bye.